I'm Stephen Smith from the Boston Globe and this is Be Well Boston. Turkey and dressing and mashed potatoes and oh don't forget the pumpkin pie. Thanksgiving is almost here, the season of gluttony. Joan Salga Blake of Boston University Sargent College is here to tell us that there's a way to trim 1,000 calories from Thanksgiving dinner, a thousand? Isn't that mind boggling? But it is, and it's just a matter of trimming a little bit on each course. You know, the first thing is the turkey that you also love, but just instead of taking six ounces, take three ounces and take off the skin, you could cut about 200 calories just from that part of your plate. What else? Okay, those mashed potatoes. I know you love those. I mean, instead of taking a cup, take a half a cup, and again, you're gonna cut out about 200 calories. And you know that green bean casserole your grandmother makes? Nah. So next time, now you bring the, the green beans, and what you may wanna do is do a stir fry and make them sauteed. Now, of course, Thanksgiving's just the start of the holiday food binging. How can we pace ourselves through Thanksgiving and then the end of the year holidays? You know, it's so true because tis the season. It starts in Thanksgiving, and really for us, it may go all the way to Super Bowl Sunday. And so what you want to do is really watch the amount of alcohol that you're drinking. Because believe it or not, if even you go to one or two more parties than you normally do per week and have two glasses of wine, that can add up and add up quickly. And we know that sometimes when you have a glass of wine, well, it affects your willpower and you end up eating more. Terrific advice, Joan Salga Blake. Thank you. And for continuing health news, stay with boston.com health and the Daily Dose blog at boston.com slash daily dose.